Chef Lisa Books Williams of ThriveHolistic.com in Pleasanton, California, and I'm here to show you how to make a low carb portobello mushroom recipe. This unique and creative portobello fajita recipe doesn't involve any cooking, and it's very low in carbs, but very high in flavor. So here's what you need to get started. A cutting board, a knife, and a spatula. You'll also need a gallon-sized sealable plastic bag and a blender. So the ingredients that you'll need are two portobello mushrooms cut, de-gilled, and cut into julienne strips, a bell pepper cut into julienne strips, an onion cut into strips, and a half a bunch of cilantro chopped. For the marinade, you'll need a handful of cherry tomatoes or one tomato chopped, two tablespoons of lime juice, a fourth of a cup of olive oil, an eighth of a cup of water, a jalapeno that has been seeded, and two garlic cloves. The spices you'll use in this recipe are two tablespoons of chili powder, a tablespoon of cumin, a tablespoon of paprika, a teaspoon of salt, and a fourth a teaspoon of cayenne. The first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is to remove the stem, and usually it just pops out like this. Next, you're going to wanna to take a spoon so you can scoop out the inner gills. And you can do this by taking the end of the spoon and scraping kind of towards you. So this is what it looks like after it's been degilled. Now we cut our portobello mushroom into julienne strips and we're going to put this plastic bag along with our onion, bell pepper, and cilantro. And then we're going to set this aside and make our marinade. Now we've put all of our marinade ingredients in the blender and we're going to blend together until smooth. Now we're going Marinade and pour it into the plastic bag that contains all of our vegetables. Now this is going to naturally cook everything and make it nice and soft and tender, just as if it were cooked. So we're going to seal the bag and make sure we get the air out of the bag in the process. And now here comes the fun part. We're just gonna massage the vegetables. And this is going to help to release their natural juices. Now we're going to leave this for about an hour for the vegetables to soften. So instead of the traditional tortilla or taco shell, which is very high in carbs and about 200 calories, we're going to use a romaine lettuce leaf, which is very low in carbs and calories. Mmm. Mmm. This is so delicious. Mmm. This is Chef Lisa Books Williams wishing you many blessings and joyful eating.